Hey everyone, Connie Jacob here from the Healthy, Wealthy and Wise Coaching Program, where we get to influence and coach people. What does that mean? What does it mean to have influence? What does it mean to be a coach? Really all it is, is knowing who you are, what you have come through and passing those things on. I wanna demonstrate with this sachet. I want you to pretend that this sachet is your life. And in your life, when you think about who are you? What are the experiences that have shaped you? What are the people, the mentors, the, the betrayals, the words that have been spoken to you that have made you who you are? Things like words, labels, mentors, relationships, professional uh, relationships, things that have happened in your life, the circumstances that have happened in your life, they get added to you. But what's the problem is, is that when we just keep it to ourselves, when we hoard all of those experiences to ourselves, eventually my arm gets tired and I can't hold it anymore. And maybe what ends up happening is instead of having influence, I become someone who's bitter, who is skeptical, who says some things like, I dreamed, but it didn't work out because I wasn't giving away what I've been given. Imagine for a minute though, I passed on to you the nuggets that I learned from heartache, the nuggets that I learned from hard relationships, the nuggets that I learned from success and in business or in relationships or the words that have been spoken over my life. What if I gave those things away? Well, I become lighter and influence is spread. And here's the thing, here's what's in each one of those sachets, it's a key. Each one of you has been given a key. It, you've been given something that could unlock things for other people. And yes, can your pain unlock something for someone else? Absolutely, because you've been through hell and back and you know how to get out. And now you give that key to somebody else and they're able to get out too. You've had success. You are a chapter or two ahead of somebody. You give the key to somebody else. You become lighter. The only person who really changes in a coaching experience is yourself. You pass on legacy. You pass on tools and strategies that can help somebody else. You grab your hand into the dirt and you say, I'm not letting go until you come out with me. And in return, of course we all know, that person changes too. So that's all that influence is. Influence is taking the experiences of your life and passing them on. It doesn't have to be perfect. And it doesn't mean that you've had an amazing experience in this life. In fact, whatever you've been given, if you don't pass it on, it weighs you down. So, are you called for influence? Give whatever you have away. Give it away.